tops in the Ivy League in scoring, rebounding, assists, and steals, uh, fifth in steals. So she's having herself quite a year. Dave right off the tip, Cornell. They work it right, stopping, arching, rattling home of three is Allie Harlan. He makes, misses, and dead balls. Right side it goes, another three-point attempt. Bury that one for Allie Harlan. Summer Hall, Summer Parker Hall, got it for Cornell. Samantha Will buries the three. I put you on the spot, but you come right through. Well, I do what I can, you know. Katie Douglas go. on the roster, Dartmouth, and it really showed in that second quarter scoring drought. And just like that, on that eight nothing run, which broke an early nine nine tie, catch and shoot, drop it, Allie Harlan. But she's had limited minutes. Catch and shoot, KC. There you go. <laughs> McNicholas speeding over midcourt. Teresa Grace, KC Carter. Can she get the layup? Yes, counted. Will back into the game. Mulroy desperately needs something, and finally. A basket to handle the double team pressure. Cook, a reek to the corner it goes. Three pointer counted, McKenna Boy. Timely one at that. It's a 4.2 possession game. Will catch and shoot, misses the three. There's Mulroy. The first of the season for Cornell here at home. McKenna Boy. <laughs> Rebound, Mulroy. Here comes Ingram in transition. Off to Teresa Grace. Ties the ball game. No, it's a two point game. One point game. They want to get it in a Boyd. She'll catch it at the baseline. She'll drive left to right. Layup, McKenna Boyd. Final score in overtime is Dartmouth over Cornell, 67-64.